billowing clouds of dust herald your arrival. Dust in the air that is born from the erosion of the walls, the statues, and our own bones. These stones heard so many sins that they could do no more than succumb, shuddering before their guilty echoes. Echoes that could not bear the seclusion that I imposed upon them and that escaped from me, crawling along these walls, eroding them until their immaculate ashes buried us all. Penitent one, you will now reveal your sins, those that your tears can never atone for. to this vigil before my final journey. I, Radames, spent my long life listening to the confessions of so many burdened hearts. Even after death, I could still hear the echo of their mournful voices, begging to be heard again, pleading for confession but their pain never managed to bring tears to my eye. One of those echoes, those incessant voices, was the very voice of the miracle who commanded me to guard its sacred regret. I obeyed, and it was then that my tears did flow. Penitent one, you who come to witness the miracle Behold. The memory of him still hurts. So it was that a humble married couple, torn apart by their inability to conceive a child, entrusted themselves in their utter desperation to the miracle 
A miracle whose light seemed to have gone out in all our hearts. For having long ceased to bathe us in its benevolent radiance, we believed it extinct. The dying day already puts out its celestial light, causing my eyelids to droop. Let the miracle cast open its black gates, so I might venture to where that terrible dream, from which one never wakes, awaits. Penitent one, you have encountered one of the three regrets. The first part of the testimony of the birth has been revealed to you, and the eminent sculptor figure of the father has descended. Find the other two guardians. 